In the name of Allah, the beneficent, the merciful. When the event befalleth, there is no denying that it will befall, abasing some, exalting others. When the earth is shaken with a shock and the hills are ground to powder so that they become a scattered dust, and ye will be three kinds. First, those on the right hand. What of those on the right hand? And then those on the left hand. What of those on the left hand? And the foremost in the race, the foremost in the race. Those are they who will be brought nigh in gardens of delight. A multitude of those of old and a few of those of later time. On lined couches, reclining therein face to face. There wait on them immortal youths with bowls and ewers and a cup from a pure spring wherefrom they get no aching of the head nor any madness and fruit that they prefer and flesh of fowls that they desire and there are fair ones with wide lovely eyes like unto hidden pearls reward for what they used to do there hear they no vain speaking nor recrimination naught but the saying peace and again, peace. And those on the right hand, what of those on the right hand? Among thornless lot trees and clustered plantains and spreading shade and water gushing and fruit in plenty, neither out of reach nor yet forbidden and raised couches. Lo, we have created them a new creation and made them virgins, lovely friends, for those on the right hand, a multitude of those of old, and a multitude of those of later time. And those on the left hand, what of those on the left hand? In scorching wind and scalding water, and shadow of black smoke, neither cool nor refreshing, Lo, heretofore they were effete with luxury and used to persist in the awful sin. And they used to say, when we are dead and have become dust and bones, shall we then forsooth be raised again? And also our forefathers say unto them, O Muhammad, lo, those of old and those of later time will all be brought together to the trist of an appointed day. Then lo, ye, the erring, the deniers, ye verily will eat of a tree called Zakum, and will fill your bellies therewith, and thereon ye will drink of boiling water, drinking even as the camel drinketh. This will be their welcome on the day of judgment. We created you, will ye then admit the truth? Have you seen that which ye emit? Do ye create it, or are we the creator? We meet out death among you, and we are not to be outrun, that we may transfigure you and make you what ye know not. And verily ye know the first creation. Why then do ye not reflect? Have ye seen that which ye cultivate? Is it ye who foster it, or are we the foster? If we willed, we verily could make it chaff. Then would ye cease not to exclaim, Lo, we are laden with debt. Nay, but we are deprived. Have ye observed the water which ye drink? Is it ye who shed it from the rain cloud, or are we the shedder? If we willed, we verily could make it bitter. Why then give ye no thanks? Have ye observed the fire which ye strike out? Was it ye who made the tree thereof to grow, or were we the grower? We, even we, appointed it a memorial and a comfort for the dwellers in the wilderness. Therefore, O Muhammad, praise the name of thy Lord, the Tremendous. Nay, I swear by the places of the stars, and lo, that verily is a tremendous oath if ye but knew, that this is indeed a noble Qur'an. 
in a book kept hidden, which none toucheth save the purified, a revelation from the Lord of the worlds. Is it this statement that ye scorn, and make denial thereof your livelihood? Why then, when the soul cometh up to the throat of the dying, and ye are at that moment looking, and we are nearer unto him than ye are, but ye see not, why then, if ye are not in bondage unto us, do ye not force it back if ye are truthful? Thus, if he is of those brought nigh, then breath of life and plenty and a garden of delight. And if he is of those on the right hand, then the greeting, Peace be unto thee, from those on the right hand. But if he is of the rejecters, the erring, then the welcome will be boiling water and roasting as hell fire. Lo, this is certain truth. Therefore, O Muhammad, praise the name of thy Lord, the Tremendous.